Hey guys, this is Pervez. Uh, first of all, thank you for all the positive feedback and comments. Uh, it is really great to know that my efforts are helping you guys. Um, you know, someone asked me, why do I do this? And, uh, you know, I came to Ireland as a student and I have been through a lot of trouble. I, and, and I don't want people to go through the same trouble again. Uh, so I try to share my own experience and mistakes so that you don't uh, have to go through it again. Um, and getting positive feedback from you helps me uh, know that all my efforts are uh, worth. So thanks once again. Um, you know, in, in my videos, I try and answer questions for people as well. Uh, in this video, I'll try and talk about uh, the most common question for the last couple of days, which is around uh, two courses, MS in Cloud Computing and MS in Data Analytics. So I've made a video where I've spoken about MS in Cloud Computing. In this video, I will talk specifically about MSC in Data Analytics. Um, so a few things that I'll share. Uh, first, you know, what is data analytics and what is it that you'll actually learn from the masters in data analytics? Um, you know, how is the masters here in Ireland? Um, what are the kind of jobs uh, that you can, uh, you know, you become eligible for once you complete your masters? Um, and what are the few things that you can actually study before coming uh, to Ireland for this course? That might help you uh, get through the course and do well. So, data analytics is used for making very crucial uh, decisions uh, in any business. Uh, example, uh, let's say I want to start my own supermarket, right? So I will have my own supermarket and I need to know how to place the products in the supermarket. And now how do I do that? First, the first month I will randomly place the products uh, in different areas in the, in the, in, in the supermarket. Um, and let's say I put uh, the daily products in the extreme left and the bread is kept on the extreme right. Now, after one month, um, I, you know, based on what products people bought and all the transactions that I have, which is the data that I, I get for, for a month, um, I can look that there is certain pattern of people who buy milk actually buy bread along with uh, that in the same transaction, which means that people are actually buying these two things together and I can actually notice a pattern. What I do from the next month is based on this analysis, next month I will place bread right next to the daily products, which means there's more chance of more people buying these two things uh, together. Thus, it helps me increase my sale. Um, you know, similarly, you could apply this for uh, an e-commerce website. You know, when you're selling products, how do you know what is the buying pattern? So all the analytics will help you do is you've got data. Now how do you find some meaning and some pattern uh, from that data? This is exactly what you'll learn during your data analytics course. Um, so you learn about um, you know using this data, uh, which comes from either unstructured source or structured source. Example is Twitter. Now Twitter has unstructured data. You've got so many tweets. How do you analyze all the tweets and try to make some decision based on how people are reacting to a particular event? Similarly, Facebook, etc. So all this is used today uh, uh, to to you know to make uh, your business do well, and this is why uh, analytics is important. During the course, you will most likely learn about uh, R, R programming language. Have a look at that. Uh, you'll learn about Hadoop. Um, and you will learn about uh, Tableau, uh, which is used for visualization. Uh, you will learn about machine learning. Uh, you will learn a little bit about uh, NLP. Uh, you know, so these are the different things that you will be learning during your uh, masters in data analytics. Uh, and what you can do in order to you know prepare yourself if you decide to to uh, take up masters in data analytics is you can actually start looking at R programming. You know, this is very uh, widely used in, in analytics. Uh, you could look at Hadoop, how the basic setup of Hadoop is. Uh, you could look um, at Python programming language. That is very important in analytics. Um, you know, if you're not a programmer, um, it's, it's not a big drawback, but 
knowing programming language is actually important, especially Python. Uh, so if you have time, you can learn Python programming language. Um, and you can also look at Tableau. There are some courses on um, Coursera that you can do in order to prepare yourself for the course. Um, you know, after you complete your master's, the kind of roles uh, that you would be eligible for are, um, you know, within analytics, you could be doing a lot of different things. Um, such as you could be you could be working on machine learning or you could be working as an NLP uh, or an NLP expert depending on the the experience you have um, you could be working as an analyst you could be working on Tableau uh, you know etc but this 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 is majorly the kind of kind of um, job that you would do um, you know so you, you need to be sort of good with uh, with math statistics you need to be at least interested in few things um and if you are then then certainly it, it it's, it's a good choice um you would also be looking at artificial intelligence which is quite widely used today uh so these are some you know some of the things that you might be doing in the next few years if you take up the course and you get a job in analytics um you know which course to select is your decision you have to think about it uh, but this is exactly what you would expect from an analytics degree uh, masters again you would have a thesis at the end so you have to go through uh, you know a lot of research papers try to come up with a research question and then have your thesis where you which you which you work on in the in the last semesters if you like my video please like and subscribe to my channel uh, and if you have any questions let me know in the comments and i'll try and answer those questions for you Thank you.